everyone and welcome back uh, today I have other things to do actually but hopefully by the end of the video I'll be able to get the last egg because this is not supposed to take too long uh, first things first uh, there's gonna be a creature here that we're gonna have to get and remember that we already took a picture of a pirate so here's where we're gonna use it. <laughs> the other uh, house on the left to this one, we're gonna get to that ma later on, because there are a couple of things we need. Uh, this guy, uh, well, there's a seahorse here. Says he wants help, wants to go uh, to Pinnacle Rock or Pinnacle Rock, and he will give me the the seahorse in exchange of a picture. This is one of the too many reasons of why we can't go back in time just yet because we need uh, we needed the picture with us, we need the the amount of eggs that we have to turn in because if we go back they're gonna reset. <clears throat> so now that we have the the horse, the seahorse, we're gonna go over here now because since we got the hook shot we have access to a new area <coughs> and we're gonna get something really good so let's go over here it's uh, again back at the waterfall since I I believe last time I said that there's something there that uh, there's more stuff there but we can't get them at the moment so that right now we have the hook shot and we can go up these uh, palms are really hard to see it the first first time you go through here. But fortunately... Oh wait. We're gonna be able to stick our, our hook shot on, onto them and get up there. This was pretty well hidden, I guess. Like, the first time I, ran, I uh, went through this game, I don't think I saw this place. Maybe like the second time I did. Because <coughs> I, I think back then I saw in a magazine a couple of characters that I never saw before. And I thought that it was kind of weird that I missed something like that. <coughs> and in the magazine you could have seen uh, yourself racing uh, these characters. And I was like, what the hell? So the second time I went through the game, I saw this place. I guess the first time, I, I was just kind of in a hurry to see what, what was going to happen in the end, which is also a mistake. Believe it or not, if you don't do a couple of things in this game, you won't be able to see the whole cutscene in the end. Cutscenes in the end require you to have special... Uh, well, let's say there are particular masks that if you don't get them, you're not going to be able to see all of the cutscenes in the end. Instead, you're, you're just going to see a mask spinning around, which is the mask that you the, that you missed. The first time I did miss a lot of masks, so I really didn't wasn't able to see a lot of things. <coughs> I got to target this guy. That's why I'm trying to look for him for a while. So basically, now we're going to talk to this guy. He's going to say that we are going to race him, but it's actually just us following him. Because it's technically impossible to get past him. We're just going to try and keep up and pass through all of the rings. These rings aren't like uh, invisible rings that you can just uh, go through them. You have to go through the holes because if you, if you don't, you can crash onto them. Even if you miss one, you're gonna lose, so you're gonna have to go through all of them. <coughs> it's quite easy, I guess. Uh, there's a second race after this. It's a little, little, just a little tiny bit more complicated, but it's really no big deal. Oh, I don't know why I did that. <laughs> you don't have to go through the small holes like he does. Just go through the rings, I guess. Okay, and no, I don't know how he can breathe on the water, but yeah, 
I think it's a beaver, right? Or... So I, I highly doubt it's a squirrel. I think it's a beaver, I don't know. Something like that. Those uh, creatures that build stuff with their uh, wood and use their tails. Or something like that. Whatever. <laughs> Anyways. Oh, That was me crashing, my bad. But it's really no big deal, because even the timer helps that if you get there on time, that's what's important. And that you don't miss rings. <coughs> so there we go, we got to the end. And now he's freaking out, because he promised me a reward, but he doesn't want to give it to me. His big brother is like, oh, no, 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 and stuff like that. <laughs> and I do hope the name of the creature that I named before doesn't give you any ideas. Because I believe there's a reference to something, uh, uh, you know, intimate <laughs> with that name on it. So, yeah. Dirty mind. Dir I'm just watching out for the dirty minds out there, you know. I got friends that each time, each t each time I say something, they go like, "Oh," they go like, "Huh," yeah, like I meant that. <laughs> I guess I'm trying to make this as po uh, clean as possible so that it's viewable by everyone. Don't want any parents thinking that it, this is kind of like a Let's Play Perf version 3.0 or something like that. Though there are pornographic games out there back in uh, Japan, I guess they do admit that kind of stuff over there. But I guess it's good that kids get to see all that stuff sooner, because they're gonna see it sooner or later, I guess. But that's just my opinion, I guess. <laughs> okay. Too much talking about random stuff. Uh, I went through the race twice on, on camera because I don't want uh, anyone getting all weird out uh, thinking that or well asking questions later of how to beat this race <clears throat> so I'm just showing you straight up uh, we're almost there come on and there we go and now they go like blah blah blah, they don't have a choice but to give it to me. And there we have it, the bottle. This is what we needed before, but oh well. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna skip my travel back to, to the fortress. I hope you guys remember that spot that I told you back at the fortress where you stump this uh, switch with the Goron form. Here's the thing that I told you, the shortcut. You're gonna be able to get here faster without necessarily going through the holes and the water and all that stuff. And now that we re we're just gonna get the last egg, which is on the other side. Ah, uh, there we go. <laughs> uh, we don't really don't have to take them out, but I'm just making sure I don't get caught. <coughs> As you can see over here, we have things to climb up. There's only one entrance. There's also an en uh, a way out, but it's really no use to, uh, to us because, you know, that door we see over there? Because remember, we can just teleport out of here, so it's no big deal. Or at least I think it's no big deal unless there's something there, like a piece of heart that I don't know of. Or that I don't remember. So, <laughs> uh, for those who know, uh, let me know in the comments below, just in case, and I can just come back here and get it. All right, another uh, mini battle with the girls that bleed purple blood or bluish, dark bluish blood. Because it's wrong to see red blood, and it's right to see blue blood. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know where people's uh, priority, pri priorities are, because blue blood or red blood is basically the same thing to me. I don't know. 
Alright, so let's get the last egg, but remember the last egg from this fortress. We're still missing three eggs that are back at the... Uh... Whatchamacallit? That place. Oh, why did I take my mask off? Ah! Anyways. Let's pick this up. And I ran out of time. I'll see you guys on the next part. Take care. Bye-bye.